Peace to everybody back with another video. This is Cat Isn't Sure Why Baby Keeps Trying to Use His Chair. And as you can see here in the screenshot is the kitty with the baby uh, sharing the chair together. Flynn had never been a super snuggly kind of cat before until he realized his mom was pregnant. So Flynn is the cat's name. Um, he is a super snuggly kind of cat. He's never been like a super snuggly cat before. And then and, and until, until Flynn realized that mom was pregnant, Flynn became really protective and cuddly. Rachel Franzen, Flynn's mom, told the dodo. He began following me around the house. So Flynn became very protective of Rachel Franzen. Um, of course, she was pregnant, and he began following her around the house. And as you can see here is Flynn, the cat, on the chair, and then the baby inside the bassinet. The moment Franzen brought her son Rory home for the first time, Flynn fell in love with his new baby brother, and it seemed like he'd known He'd been waiting for his best friend all along. Flynn loves his new baby brother so much and especially loves all the fun new toys he came with. So Flynn, Flynn the cat fell in love with the baby right away as soon as mom brought the baby home. Um, and, um, and especially all the fun new toys he came with. And of course, you know, Flynn is a cat that will follow you around the house and you know it's like cats do strange things and here's the screenshot of Flynn with the baby when Flynn's mom first brought out the new baby bouncer he was so excited but he didn't seem to realize that the comfy chair wasn't meant for him so when mom brought out the bouncer, the baby bouncer, uh, Flynn got excited, but he didn't seem to realize that the comfy chair wasn't meant for him. So the bouncer wasn't for Flynn, it was for the baby. Flynn is in the bouncer every morning, Franzen said. He definitely thinks it's his. He will sit in it and roll upside down and want to have his tummy rub. It's his after breakfast sleep spot. So that's what Flynn thinks this chair is for. Is for him to. To. For him only. But he doesn't realize that it's for the baby. But of course he likes to um, roll upside down. And want to have his tummy rub. And um, she said that it's his after breakfast sleep spot. So as you can see here. Here's where Flynn is taking a nap or going to sleep in the bouncer that belongs to the baby. Franzen has the bouncer set up in the bathroom so that she can watch Rory easily while she's getting ready in the morning. Often by the time she's ready to put Rory in there, Flynn has already set up camp and while she usually just shoes him away so mom was getting ready she had the baby with her and um because she was getting ready i guess she was getting ready to go to work or something who knows but flynn would just set himself make camp in the bouncer and she usually just shoes him away but i i guess she decided not to maybe she did who knows She realized that putting Rory right on top of Flynn works too. So mom decided to set the baby on top of the cat too. Because you know Flynn would not move. And and I, and I guess the cat didn't seem to mind that the baby was on top of the kitty. So and of course as you can see here in the screenshots of the baby with the cat...
Flynn loves Rory, so he licked R- Rory's hand and then started grooming himself, Franzin said. By the time I got my phone to take pictures, he just stared at me and at Rory. If I hadn't moved Rory, Flynn would have stayed like that all day. So Mom was gonna get the f- was gonna take a picture with her phone, but she but instead Flynn just stared at her and Rory. And if she said if I hadn't moved Rory, Flynn would have stayed like that all day. Flynn didn't seem at all phased or bothered by having Rory snuggled up next to him and was probably just wondering why Rory was trying to use what was clearly his chair. So Flynn didn't seem phased. So, you know, cats, they, if you think something's going to phase them, no. It, it didn't phase him or bothered him by having Rory snuggled up next to him. And, of course, was probably just wondering what if Rory was trying to use what he was clearly his chair. And as you can see, Rory and the, the kitty together. <coughs> Luckily, Flynn loves Rory. And is good at sharing. So they stayed cuddled up like that until it was time to move on. And there's no doubt that there will be many more bouncer chair cuddle sessions in the future. (coughs) So So luckily Flynn does love Rory. He loves the baby. And also Flynn is good at sharing. So they stayed cuddled up like that until it was time to move on. So Flynn didn't want to move anywhere, but sooner or later, Flynn had to move on. And of course, there's no doubt that there will be many more bouncer chair cuddle sessions in the future. So you never know if they will or not. But you know, babies grow quick. And of course, the kitties... They, they like anything that the baby has. And, you know, and it, I guess the cats do strange things. They make sure you're okay. They see things that we cannot see. Um, and if there's something wrong, they'll hiss or meow or whatever. And that's just how cats are. But, and this cat was protective of mom when she was pregnant with Roy. Leave your comments below. I am out.